What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Um, picking up right where we left off. Gonna check out what's inside this temple. I'm actually really curious. I didn't like ending where we left last time. <laughs> Different than the other tomb. I don't know. I don't like it. Alright. Let's get cracking. I really expect him to go into a wall run for some reason. But it really tripped me up when he just stopped and stuck to the wall. She's a liar. How? I rerouted communication the moment you tried to contact her. Nice. Slicing encrypted transmissions was always a pastime of hers. She taught me once. There's no technique there has that I haven't perfected. Oh, it's just this thing, okay. That's fine. Oh, didn't interrupt him. I don't understand, why is it working? This is not too bad to fight normally, but I'm surprised that this guy counts as like a different enemy that can't be interrupted with the force push. Can we scan him then? No. It's just another Tomb Guardian. Strange. More puzzles, huh? Oh, that's broken. Can't use the force push on that. Alright. Um... Is this climbable, maybe? No. Huh. Okay. My friend. These devices appear to simulate this planet's gravitational pull. I can't help but see it as a motif. Oh, did I just extinguish it? Oh man. I feel like those might be important. I don't know. Keep it in mind. Running out of time. For what? My scouts located an artifact. That was a solid jump. An artifact of interest at the rear of this tomb. Even now, I'm studying it, learning his secrets. It seems Cordova was rather taken with these Zephyr. Perhaps enough to hide the holocron amongst their bones. Yeah, we'll see how much you learn. I did not think all these guys would be chilling upstairs here. I got the two down here. Oh, please. All right, there we go. 
I didn't need backup anyway. Uh, okay. All right, let's try group slow without locking on. I don't think I held it that time, to be honest. And now I'm out of force. All right. I think you're scared. He's killing us. We don't even have to try here. All right, let me try again. I missed one. I don't understand why that ability never works for me. Well, his fate was sealed either way. Hmm, okay. Oh, so that's the gravity thing. I, I see you now. All right. Um, for a mess with that, let's climb up here and check this out. Another one over here, and I think BD scans something or wants to. What's behind door number one? Nice job. Need one of those burning things again. Oh, damn it. Why? Alright, so this is blocked. Alright. Don't have to mess with it then. Oh. There's our sphere. Wanna check it out? Oh, you found something. So up above us is the way forward. Hey, BD, let's go. Alright, we can push this, right? No? Alright, that's just because the gravity's on. But, what does that accomplish? Is it just to climb up where it came from, maybe? Yeah, it looks like it. I'm trying to bait me to this guy. Right? Maybe. Need assist. I feel like I dodged that. I don't know about you. Is that rat gonna jump in? I swear. I hate you. I hate your entire species. Can't you be interrupted? I don't understand.
Okay, so that's nothing. I think I saw a meditation spot up here. Yeah. We'll definitely partake. I'm upset that I missed that. I really am. Oh, that was another... Wait. That's on the floor below. So is this just the end? I think I need a new power to be able to take care of these branches here. And that rope is, uh... Glowing red, it seems to, so I'm gonna assume that this is a dead end. Who's back there? And can we get to that? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Unexplored path is this way. Thought we'd have to backtrack a ways, but I guess not. This tomb is really cool. More of my soldiers breach this tomb every minute. Afraid to face me yourself? Had your droid not intervened, I would have killed you with ease. <laughs> Probably true. It's okay, buddy. Just ignore her. Hmm. Interesting. Blasting those with the force is just the greatest feeling. Finish this guy real quick. That'd be ideal. I don't do that. There we go. Oh, you go pretty far, huh? That gives me an idea. Oh, I ran out of force. Hold on, I will make this work. Haha! <laughs> yes. You're not getting out of here alive. Don't make me fight one of them here. Okay. For a second I contemplated whether I would have preferred him to just like drop on that narrow pathway I was on or if I had to fight like a ship. And I was like, you know, I'd probably prefer the ship actually. I see you, Jedi. Oh, you see me? What a big flex. Why am I always just out of force when I need it most? Can I just come up? Thank you. I hate that they just like get to do their whole combo even if I deflect the beginning of it. Oh, 
I should probably back up and heal. You'll never get the chance to miss again, because you're dead. I wish there was like a practice or training mode somewhere. I guess it could be and I'm just not aware of it, but like I feel like when I'm fighting someone tougher like the purge troopers, I'm not like going with full intent to kill most of the time. I'm kinda just trying to like get a feel for the lightsaber combat. What? Why? Why did you do that? Just hold on to it. Five head. I have no idea why I slipped off. Um, but yeah, like, I just enjoy the opportunity to practice fighting them. Jedi. Ha. I'll get through. It's much like Sekiro, actually pulling off the combat in a kind of a fluid way. Doing it right, I guess you could say, is very, very satisfying. Okay, I want to get up there somehow. Repress this, repressing this help at all? No, I don't think it would. Well, let's check the map first of all. Oh, a shortcut, huh? Or no, green just means available, not necessarily shortcut. Hmm. Let's investigate for a moment. Me. Oh wait, can I climb that? No, probably not. That branch seems important. Seems like you jump down to it though, maybe? Ah, eh, maybe not. Maybe you jump up. Alright, let's press on and see if we can reach that branch, maybe, from the other side. Wait, what? Hold on, I have an idea. It takes a moment for that to spin up and engage the gravity, right? So we press again. Now we just latch onto it. Easy as that. Didn't expect it to just go like that. Glad my character held on. Also, apparently we can slow them. So there's that too. Uh, yeah, this definitely didn't get me any closer. Huh. What did this accomplish? Okay. Bear with me a moment. Can I hit the rat with this? See how good with the force I am. <laughs> I love it. Oh, come on. I hate you. Just for that. Going bye-bye. Um, can we climb to the top of that? No. Over here, maybe? No, okay. Just need more vines. In that case... Maybe we can ride this... Oh my god. Sometimes I feel like I stick to these balance beams. Sometimes you just don't. Guess what happened that time. Yeah, see when he's like... Got his hands out like that? I, I actually can't walk off. Anyways, let's press the button again. I just realized while I'm like trying to figure this out, I don't actually know how to progress forward either, to be perfectly honest. Alright, let's backtrack to that one then. I don't know how I'm supposed to hit the button though. I'm just <laughs> thinking one step at a time and not too far ahead. Huh, okay.
Oh. Wait a minute. There's some vines over there. I missed them the first time. Nope, that one. There we go. Get out of here. I don't know how I didn't notice this. Some of you in the comments are probably screaming. I don't know how I feel about saving a rat just then. Kind of goes against everything I stand for. But I don't really like the flame trooper guys either, so. There's that. How funny would it have been if it actually just let me bump him off the edge he just jumped over? Help, BD. Oh, come on. That was close. I got an achievement for kicking uh, Phylac, I think it was said it was called. Kicking it after it kicked me. Sure, it's worth the cost. I hear Project Augur came at a high price. Stormtroopers and workers. Expendable resource. You're a monster. I am what says. I don't know why I'm complaining about realism, or lack thereof, in the Star Wars game, but it's a little unrealistic how quickly that burns the branches, don't you think? Okay, we made it up here. Oh, hello. And there's that door from earlier. Looks like, with the exception of whatever that is, we pretty much went everywhere we were meant to. I still think that the sphere is inside. Oh, no. Damn. No! Oh, they're mutual enemies. Yes, kill him. Look, the rats are about to solo a purge trooper. I mean, there's three of them, but... Rat solo. See? They're strong, I'm telling you guys. He didn't stand a chance. the worst situation. I've taken the artifact back to my ship for analysis. Pity you couldn't make it in time. Doesn't matter what you steal, you'll never understand it. All right. Can you do? You'll find out soon. Uh, maybe slow and then jump over? Oh yeah, that's right. I'm physically incapable of slowing more than one person at a time. Did you guys just trip over each other? Let's take him on! Alright, that worked out.
juggling the ranged troopers behind you and to the side of you and up above and down below and also the lock on and sprinting and blocking and deflecting and dodging might as well throw that in there too kind of a lot to handle believe it or not I can make that jump right made it safely over assuming we make this jump and we did all right this looks like could be painful pretty simple pattern though I just had to stare at that for a second and figure out where I went wrong. Another save point would be kind of nice. Having more stims or having them heal more would also be pretty nice. Asking you shall receive. Still no skill point, wow. Double check the map. Didn't miss anything in that hallway, cool. Um, what is down here? Oh, is that the way forward then? Oh, okay. Shout out to the fact that I saw an empty spot for a ball earlier in the level, and this whole time I've kind of just been trying to find one. I noticed something while examining the sarcophagus. It's a very convenient location to dispose of nuisances. You lured me here. Was this your plan all along? You truly have the wits of a scrapper. No way. No way. You didn't hear anything, dude. Eh, none of them look too terribly dangerous. Let's just hop up. Someone's about to come out of that ship. Oh, yeah. For sure. I'm not too slow. I just don't get it. It doesn't work. Come on. I'll drop him. No, you won't. He might. Keep attacking him. He won't stand still. After him. Ah, boy. Hurry, take him down. Little help, BD. Come on. They always sync up their attacks. <laughs> Damn you, dude. <laughs> get out of my face. Can't get a counter hit in. Shove off. That reminds me of something. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> you shove off. They're dropping reinforcements right behind me. Damn it. It's so inconsistent as to whether or not my first deflect staggers him like that or he just follows up with another attack. I can never tell. Oh, it's the posture bar. That's what the difference is. I gotta look at his posture bar more closely. See, that time it wasn't empty, so he followed up another attack. This time, if I get another deflect, I need to. There we go, see? Didn't follow up. Oh, you just waited? That was actually very honorable of you. I can't even be mad. Oh, no, we're following. I'm about to learn force pull. I can feel it. Padawan, where is the force? Inside me. It is within me. It surrounds me. Just so. Also it everywhere else. There will be times when emotion, pain, or exhaustion trick you. You will feel cut off, isolated. This is an illusion. Your lightsaber lies there, out of reach, but you remain connected through the Force. Feel that energy around you, and summon your weapon. The Force is within you, around you, connecting you to your weapon. You must ignore all distraction. Got it. The force is with me. It connects us. Yeah, I think so. All right. Let's say my objective is just to explore the tomb now. Still need those uh, flaming orbs for these branches though, right? Oh wait, there's some... Uh Oh, I can hold it. If I let go as a push it, it just drops it. But I can combo that into a push, I imagine. If I just press the push button from here. Oh, beautiful. You survived. Not part of course, of your I survived. Plan. Luckily, I always allow contingencies. Alright, we got some new abilities. Let's go. Um, Let's see, where do we start? Howling push, powerful push, allowing Cal to send groups of enemies flying and knock down large targets. Holding pull allows Cal to pull and hold most enemies. Large enemies can be yanked towards Cal. The power of friendship. BD1 stim canisters completely refill your force meter. Oh, interesting. Maximum force increased. Increase the range of Cal's lightsaber throw. Okay, I have a lightsaber throw right there. Uh, throw a lightsaber forward before pulling it back, hitting any enemies along the way. I need that. You don't even understand how badly. Um, maximum life increased, and Cal recovers additional life when using a stim canister. Kind of assume that's what that would be. All right. Uh, the the choice is clear. We are just gonna wait until we have three points to grab lightsaber throw. Easy as that, my friends. Now where do we go? Raise the spire, that's right. Okay. Um, nice little shortcut now that we have that pull too. 
Yeah, next episode, I'm definitely gonna go back to, uh, the old planets and just kind of tie up loose ends. Um, and by that, I mostly mean look for things I missed. Can I pull these things? Oh, hell yeah. You can't beat us. I need more force. He's too far away. We'll take you down. The one thing that continues to bother me about the deflection in this game. In most games, there's multiple enemies stacked up. Um, think like the Arkham games, or maybe like Assassin's Creed Odyssey or Origins, one of the new ones. Oh, we have to use pull to interrupt these guys. Makes sense now. I gotta roll away from that. Invade's not doing it. But yeah, anyways, when there's multiple enemies grouped up, you and, and you like deflect two of them at like basically the same time, or you deflect one of them while the other one's simultaneously swinging at you. Usually, it'll send out kind of like a little shock wave, and it'll knock both of them back. You'll only like truly deflect the one that you're hitting, but it'll stop the attack animation of the other guy. I feel like this game desperately needs that mechanic. Or maybe it has and I'm just doing something wrong. Like I said, a practice mode would be kind of nice. But I feel like, especially when the enemies tend to like walk side by side, and um... Do I just pull this away? Okay. But yeah, they... Can I walk it? Tie it down maybe? Oh, nice. I can't believe that worked. But yeah, they walk side by side, attack at the same time. There's no way to, like, really counter that. You just have to wait for a better opportunity later on. go over there. Absolutely cyber bullied. Okay, can I hold this guy if I pull him? No, it just kind of drags him towards me a little bit. Oh, that deflected both of them. But see, those were like perfectly timed attacks, I feel like. Meant to hit this guy, if I'm honest. See if I can take care of that droid. Doesn't seem to want to attack me now. Come on, please. This is so annoying, dude. Imagine having your helmet just like ripped apart by a lightsaber like his literally smoldering and still talking trash. <laughs> that swift little poke. Wait, did I cut him in half? Nah, he's just like clipping through the floor. All good, bro, all good. Um uh, guessing he wants me to pull this rope down here. I 
I love that I don't even pull it down, it just gets summoned to my hand. Oh wait, no. Just close. I'll let that battle run its course. Come on. That's what you get, dude. Karma. I have half health. This was no stims. Did I miss a uh, save point? Precious. I missed something. I'm confused. What is this? It says available. Feeling okay? What is available? Oh wait, is this uh where I tie it? Okay, that's what it is. So it may be be a shortcut back, but oh well. This is just happening. Him through my guard, I'm upset. If I line this up, will the stormtrooper maybe shoot him in the back? Aggro him, even. Monster close by. Feel like he's right behind. No, he can't get through, can he? What does this do? Ah ha ha! What? My idea was so good though. This is a top tier strategy for this fight though, I'm not gonna lie. Easy peasy. Alright, now where then? That's right, there's a bunch of those vines. Um, should we just backtrack and rest up here? It's a rhetorical question that's happening. Uh, rest. Probably gonna respawn that monster. Oh well. You win some, you lose some. So what would be... This is my main objective, isn't there? Oh, raise the spire. Okay, so we probably have to just solve some kind of puzzle here. This guy is an elite soldier. Not that elite though. Okay. So. Can I just pull this down maybe? Yeah, I didn't think so. We need to make our way up again. Well, this takes us up a little bit. Progress. I really just want to let this play out so they can feel my pain. Unfortunate for you. Okay. There's a rope thing there. Wait, I fell. 
This is bad. Let go of the rope, damn it. Monster's down here somewhere. There he is. Hey, <laughs> what's up, pal? Mind if I squeeze through here? <laughs> Obviously you do. Alright, that was a complete and utter failure. Really no other <laughs> words to describe it. So, there's got to be something for me to attach that rope to. This, maybe. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. Well, if I could just... Oh, I forgot. I can't push these guys. i got to pull them. I was about to say, what if I pushed them off the edge? Believe it or not, I was thinking about force pushing an enemy off the edge instead of fighting them the right way. I know it doesn't sound like me, but that's really what I was thinking. Maybe we do just go this way. Can I make this jump? Oh, we did actually. Wow, this camera angle is not ideal. Hmm. Oh, that's not an anchor point. I'm dumb. Okay, we need a different anchor point then. Where could it be? I did notice something, however. There are branches on that chain. Dare I say they might be what's holding that thing up. Actually, I might be able to see on the map where to anchor this. That's definitely it, right? Dude, let me have my camera back. It doesn't belong to you. No, a leash is here. Okay. Let's try this from down here. Oh, wait. I think I see the thing. I'm dumb. All right, now we need one of those things from the wall. Whoops. <laughs> what if I sent that over my head backwards and just hit the thing? Greatest of all time. It's gonna be a bit of a snipe. Do you have to hit the target for it to be considered a sniper shot? Try this again. Hmm, it's being doused to that water. Okay. Interesting development. In that case, let's check out these now available pathways. Tie it off of there. Branches behind us. We probably can't. Mm. About to get doused while we walk through there. Yep. Alright. Oh no. Okay. Some more water here still. Any torch objects? Hmm. So I would say our goal is probably to shut off the water somehow. From the source. All there is in this hallway is branches. 
This uh, rope seems to be the only thing I haven't really interacted with yet. Oh, there's another one up here, too. How do I get there, though? Guess we just keep moving up. Oh, there's a scan here. I can't remember how I got out of this room originally. <laughs> oh, up here. That's right. Uh, we gotta turn the gravity off. So I gotta break the rope. Sort of. Request the hint. It's about water. How can we stop the candles from getting doused? Okay. <laughs> I forget I have the hint thing. It kind of makes. It's less fun, though. I like figuring it out. Oh, this takes us up. This is new. Where would this take me? I don't know, let's just jump. It's just a rope swing, no pressure. Oh, there's another rope there. Use them to get across the bridge. That's what I'm gathering. Oh, hello. Oh, you're the one that got killed by the rats earlier. Ah, oh, that means there's rats in this room. GG, dude. Got to deflect that time, nice. Too early. About the candles again. The same one we saw in the other tomb. Nice catch. Socket. What? I see it. There's a sphere powering that lantern. Oh, this is talking about. Yeah, we can't do anything with that yet. I figured out that much. Still need to stop the water. It seems like it would be on the other side. Or wait, no, we came from the other side, so. Should probably just keep moving this way. Oh, okay. I thought it was, like, beyond a stretch for me to be able to grab that rope over there, and then another rope just appeared in front of me. This seems like it's unrelated to the current puzzle, I'm not gonna lie. I might just head back over. In fact, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I highly doubt I need my uh, elevation to get lower to fix this water issue. Just keep looking around, I guess. Oh, goodbye. For once, a masked something actually works. Something is next to me. Smells like a ship. Oh, hello. Uh, 
I am starting to get a feel for this game. Just now. It's finally happening. Ah, I see. See the error of my ways. Uh oh. What I think I just killed the shortcut. Oh no, I can get through. Okay. <laughs> that would have been disappointing. Alright, so based on the map, this does not seem like the direction that's gonna get me anywhere. So we're gonna backtrack again. Well, that rules out at least one area. Alright, I haven't figured it out yet. Maybe? I don't know. There's not water on this side. I thought that there was. But if we get a candle just over here, it should be fine. You know, instead of trying to come at the vine from this side, just because it's slightly closer to the, uh, to the wall. Um, can I jump with this? I can't. So can I just throw it? Alright, that kind of incinerated it. Just toss it. Oh, that still didn't work. Um. Oh, wait a minute. This is a uh, magnet wall, right? The whole thing? I wonder if that would work. What is happening? Alright, just gonna give up on that one. Let's launch it straight into that beam. Yes, it sticks. Perfect. Now, I'm gonna assume that this is going to work. Just kidding, get back up to it. No, don't, oh, okay, it's stuck. Uh, we need to lower the rope again first. But yeah, assuming that this uh, plan to get the orb over here worked, I'm going to assume that this works too. Huh. I'm not entirely convinced that that wasn't just like a fluke. Then again, I felt like I noticed water on both sides earlier, so I don't know. That was a bad throw. A little higher. There we go. Let's take that back. Let's walk all the way around the side. Alright. Got it. Hell yeah. And that should come crashing down. And finally. Can I pull that? Oh, I can. Nice. Not really any advantage over pushing, to be honest, but cool nonetheless. This isn't supposed to be the hard part, work with me. Got it. Representation of this sacred Zepho artifact. My friend, look closely. This is Nictrol at the vault on Bagano. You can see an object in their hand. Based on this imagery, I believe this object allows a force wielder to perceive the mysteries of the vault. This is the key and the guide. The Zepho Astrium. But who would destroy images of it and why? Requires more research. However, our next step is clear. Find an astrium, if any still exist. 
in Astrium. You ever heard of it? Me neither. Very key. Yeah, I understand that. Looks like we know what we have to find. All right. Whoa, what? What? It said raise the spire, but I thought that it was just the little... Okay. That's where we are now. Alright, well, I'm going to wrap this episode up there. Uh, another good one, I feel like. It's fun to play, at least. I don't know. Hopefully the video is good, too. I uh, just need one more skill point so we get that saber throw. Definitely looking forward to that. A lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Anyways, thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next video, and have a good day.